Before we get started, does anyone want to get out? What's going on? Welcome back to A Real and Beer. Just a friendly reminder, you're only as good as the chances you take. Al Pacino. All right, today we're going to be reviewing a film. Might be a little bit controversial for some people. I remember hearing about this uh, a couple of years back and I uh, didn't put too much stock into it until I started really uh, looking into it. And there's a few things that I were not Mandela effect for me. And it, but it really hit home with a few things because I, I could swear up and down. And, and there's really two that stick out to me. It's the Bernstein Bears and the other was the Sinbad movie because I'm 38, I was born in 81 and I would have bet you a hundred million dollars that I watched a Sinbad movie where he was a genie. I mean, I almost feel like I watched it. So, uh, those two things have really, I don't know, it made me kind of a believer in it. So, uh, but we finally have a movie about it. I mean, we all kind of knew that this was going to happen one day. So we've got the initial release date of December 6th, 2019. Now this is going to be released by Gravitas Ventures. And it says uh, they're mostly known for their independent releases, their independent films. But it says it's going to be released in theaters and video on demand, so I'm not really sure if it's going to be one or the other or both. Uh, I guess we'll see come December 6th. But either way, I have watched this about a quarter of it uh, before I decided, hey, yeah, this is something that I do want to do a trailer reaction to. It's got some good actors in it. They're not what I would refer, refer to as A-listers, but you'll recognize them. From some things, for example, uh, the lead actor in this, uh, from the research I did, is Charlie Hofheimer. You will know him from the movie Would You Rather, and also Black Hawk Down. And then you'll have, and I'm not sure if I'm saying this right, Aleska Palladino. Uh, you will, if you don't know the name, you will know her from the Boardwalk Empire. Uh, she was in a few episodes of The Sopranos uh, and Wrong Turn to Dead End. And by the way, if you have not seen that movie, I highly suggest it. It's uh, got very good ratings. It's by far the highest rated of the Wrong Turn franchise. Uh, but if you like gore, you'll, you'll love that movie. And then it's also got uh, Robin Lord Taylor as... A uh, supporting actor, I believe. Uh, he was also in Would You Rather. Uh, and he was in a few episodes of The Walking Dead. Now, if you don't remember, I'll go ahead and, because I had to research this myself. Um, he and his wife in The Walking Dead, uh, Rick came across them. And it was, I believe they were the second couple that Rick asked his three questions. Uh, how many walkers have you killed? How many people have you killed and why? And this is kind of an odd, you know, I don't know. It, to me, it struck me as odd, but it's got a guy by the name of uh, Clark Peters, who in the movie Endgame played Nelson Mandela. Pretty weird, huh? Comment below, let me know what Mandela effects you've had. And uh, actually stick around to the end of this video for a special giveaway. I'll tell you what that is. But right now, we're just going to jump right into it and we're going to watch the trailer for the Mandela effect. Here we go. Sam, my precious Sam. Becoming parents gave Claire and I a greater sense of purpose. Wow. Every day brought with it new memories. Each one sacred in its own way. It doesn't feel real. I know 
So, uh, like I said, I watched a quarter of the trailer. I did not get to see. Uh, I just watched the full thing with you guys. And it took a turn I was not expecting, which I've heard the simulation theory. To see the simulation world in this trailer, I'll be honest with you, it kind of lost me. Now, I... And the type of person I can, if I hear a conspiracy theory and it piques my interest, I'm like this guy. I mean, I'm on the internet searching it, uh, <laughs> and I got to find out as much as I can. And, and I think a lot of times that's what feeds into conspiracy theories with the internet. You know, if one person comes up with an idea, uh, then. I think you hear it. I don't. I do not remember a monocle on on the Monopoly Man. Uh, I, I could see why people would think that, but I, I think when you hear it enough, it's almost like it starts making you misremember. That's a Roger Clemens line for you sports guys. But overall, uh, I don't know that this. It, no, this won't be a theater movie for me. I will go see it if it's, a, you know, I, I will go check it out at Redbox and, and watch it one night. Or if it's on here on Video On Demand, watch it one night. I really was not a big fan of the turn that it took there towards the end. But let me know what you think. I mean, uh, this, that may be uh, right down your alley. You may, that may, you may not have liked the beginning of it and you like the end of it. So, uh, but let, comment below, let me know what you thought. And... The giveaway so we're trying to build our fan base up we're trying to uh, release videos regularly so uh, we also have a Facebook page so what I want you to do if, you, if you're if you want to uh, go to our Facebook page it's simply a real and a beer on Facebook uh, like the page and then shoot us a message and let us know what city you're from. And in the next video, we're going to give you a shout out. So uh, do that and we'll see you. Uh, we'll, we'll give you a shout out on the next video. So uh, until the next time, this is a real and a beer. We're out.